I, I recommend sitting down with your kids and going through AI together, right? Like ask a question and then say, well, this is was really confidently said, but is that enough? When someone says something confidently, is that enough for you to believe that? And hopefully the answer is no, right? What else can you check? Can you look somewhere else? What information do you need to think about this and genuinely uh, internalize that that's correct or not? That exercise is, I think, super fruitful. And I think the, the, the converse side is to kind of demonstrate what it's like to not know something. I think that a lot of times, like showing uncertainty and uh, modeling for your kids, when you don't know something, what is your own process of finding that out, right? What is your process for learning? I think that like, uh, what, what I want to impart upon my kids is like finding the answer is just the start of your learning journey. Mm -hmm. And I think for many institutions, schools and so on, getting to the answer is really what we're testing right now. But if we get make that the beginning of someone's journey, especially learning with AI, then that I think opens up a whole series of doorways. And so yeah, at home, I, you know, try to show my process for discovering something and that adults don't always have the answers kids are super smart and they're able to find answers on their own in ways that if we just talk and ask the right questions, then they'll be able to discern for themselves what is true and what isn't and not just trust things at face value.